Uh, one thing that we're going to really address today is the positioning. As far as you see right there, your eyes even go forward, your head starts to come forward, your body's starting to lean. You can feel the weight pulling you forward. Anytime you start to go down, you have a tendency to come forward. Just like if you were to look up, a tendency to go backwards, right? So same concept. If you can find something straight ahead, if you fix yourself on the rogue sign, that's your focal point, and you keep your eyes there from the top to the bottom and back up, it's gonna help a lot. You know, where's your balance? How do you feel on your whole foot? Are your eyes straight ahead? Are your hips warmed up and loose? Are you squatting straight? You know, there's, we can make a list of a thousand different things to go over. But once you get to like 80, 90, 95%, you can't think about any of that. So it's it's gotta be ingrained. Yeah, like a robot. So whenever you're at your top weights, then you can be mindless, go blank, black, whatever. Because you can't exert maximum force if you're thinking about everything. You're gonna be hesitant, you're gonna you know, be second guessing yourself, trying to make corrections, feeling things out. You can't just go all out whenever you're doing that. Where we run into issues is if we don't have consistent movement patterns, right? Because then one squat is forward, one is backwards, we're over correcting things, we're not addressing things, then you're just lost. You're trying to fix everything at once. Where if we can create these routines and like minimize the variables, get everything under control that we can control, then there's less to think about, right? And so we're able to apply more force at the heavier weights. We're able to focus more on like the bigger issues, not on like unracking the bar and things like that. And so at like 90%, that's whenever you have to, you can't think anymore. You gotta shut, shut this off and turn this on. Uh, and so my point is like working on unracking the barbell every single time the exact same way will end up having a big result.